guys, welcome back to my channel. This is Nana, my boyfriend, and today I'm going to be showing you guys how to do a curly hair routine on men's hair. So, <laughs> so basically, focus on that, focus. So basically, I'm going to be doing his hair. Um, it's not going to be him doing my hair this time. If you guys didn't check out that video, go check it out right now. But I'm going to be showing you how to get curls in his hair. Right now, it's all non-curly. So I'm going to make his hair look really curly by loosening the curls using different products. So obviously, we're going to wet the product. I might have wet the product. So the products we're going to be using is the Cantu Leave-In Conditioner. This one's the argan oil kind. Then we're going to go in with the Eco Styler Gel. This one's the olive oil kind. Um, this stuff really, really works. So you'll see that in this video. And we're also going to be using the Denman brush. If any of you guys don't know what it is, basically it's a crazy brush that works like crazy. It curls your hair. How about the pick, then? No. No pick. Oh, no pick. No pick. Denman brush. If you haven't heard about it, research it and, yeah, check it out. But it basically curls your hair, as crazy as that sounds. So we're going to be using this. This one? I don't believe it. And then we're just going to have water. This is just in the spray bottle. Water is the major key, alright guys? Tell Water. Them. Yes. Hydration. Yes. <laughs> life. Power. He knows. So basically, you guys will see a big transformation. It's very easy, very quick, and anybody could basically do it as long as you have the right tools and the technique. Yep. So without further ado, let's get started. Okay, so to get started, we're first going to soak his hair. I'm doing this with a spray bottle, but I do suggest you guys just run the hair under a faucet of water and just let it be soaked because water is your best friend when it comes to this. Then we're going to apply leave-in conditioner. So what I'm using on his hair today is the Cantu leave-in conditioner that I mentioned earlier. And this I find really helps to find the curls. You could pretty much use any leave-in conditioner or like a curling styling cream. Pretty much anything, but this I find works best. What you want to do is put a good amount and if you do find that the hair isn't curling up as you would like, keep adding more water. Keep adding more water. You'll actually keep seeing me add water to his hair. That's because for the purpose of this video, I'm using a spray bottle instead of a faucet. But as you can see right now, once I keep adding water, his hair becomes more curlier. Wait, 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 wait. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Pause, pause, pause. See, y'all gonna act like you don't see her soaking my face? I'm drowning. <laughs> that sucks for you, but lucky you're getting your hair done. So let's get back to it. Then I go in with a gel. I'm using the Eco Styler gel. So what I basically do is I just put I put like a good amount in my hand and I rub it through his hair. But the motion I do is back and forth, as you can see here. So what this does, for some reason, it helps define your curls more. Um, everyone's hair is different, so maybe you may use a different technique. Now, if you find your hair's not curling like you want it to, it may just need more water like I said earlier. But, if you've put a lot of water and it's still not curling, you may need to go in and touch it up. So what I do here to touch up certain curls that aren't curling how I want it to, or pretty much just to make certain parts look better, I go in with a Denman brush. The Denman brush here that I'm using is the D3 Original Styling Brush, and this is the 7 row. Just look at that definition once it curls. Like this brush is amazing. I even use this on my own hair. And as you can see, I'm not taking a whole lot of time on this. I'm literally just touching it up with only certain pieces. Then just shake it, shake it, shake it, baby. Shake all the excess water out and just keep on shaking until as much as you can because you don't want the drying process to be too long. <laughs> that wink though now this is the results before I start blow drying you could either blow dry or air dry your hair whichever one you prefer but for this video we're gonna blow dry just because we have places to be people to see and we gotta go you know peep that haircut that he did on himself though like look at that look at that that triangle you know yo let me know if you want a tutorial on that I'm gonna have to do it for you guys 
So what you want to do is you want to blow dry on medium heat, so not too hot, not cold, but pretty much warm. And I usually will do it on a low setting. I find this helps to reduce as much frizz as possible and just causes less damage to the hair. And these are the final results! This literally took, I would say, about 5 minutes if anything. And these curls are just popping! Like, he never really thought he could get curly hair like this, so for him to be rocking it, he is so happy. So I'm just hoping that this helps one of you guys out. So leave a comment if it did. Let me know if you want to see more men hair tutorials. And be sure to give this video a thumbs up and subscribe! Thank you.